Robotic surgery was first introduced in 1985 in the, in the, in the United States, but in, in the year 2000, the Da Vinci Group brought out a, a fantastic robot that is now being used for many, many disciplines in surgery. Liverpool Hospital will be one of a handful of formal academic training programs around the world that will offer formal training to robotic surgery. The Mimic robot is a unique uh, machine. Uh, it allows a trainee, a doctor, a surgeon, a nurse to train on robotic surgery without necessarily inflicting any injury to any patients. It allows the surgeon to acquire all the skills and then go on to the operating room. The programs in the Mimic become more and more complex. So you start off with a very simple program, then you move on to the next program and the next program. So rather than learning these skills at the operating table, the surgeon learns these skills in a simulation. This is a great project, very exciting for Liverpool Hospital. We will become world leaders in this type of project. It is not common to have robotic surgery in a public hospital. There's been a strong community focus on fundraising and being involved in this type of project and the community see the benefits to not only themselves but to their families and the rest of the community. So we've started off with the urology group, then we're going to move into gynae oncology, then we're going to move into colorectal surgery and then we'll move into ENT and head and neck surgery. So there are significant groups and senior clinicians already at Liverpool Hospital that have been trained in this type of technology but moving forward we're going to train the next generation of surgeons. The Da Vinci robot's a fantastic machine for performing radical prostatectomies. It gives us three dimensional vision and ten times magnification when we look down the binoculars and that allows us to see things in a far superior way to standard open or laparoscopic surgery. The benefit of doing this is that we're able to get a fantastic view of the nerves which supply erections as well as the muscles which control continence in men. It also allows us to have the best chance of curing patients with prostate cancer. It's extremely exciting that this world leading technology will be available at Liverpool Hospital and that we'll be able to use it for all of our patients who come through this great hospital.